The Wright brothers weren't the first, or were they? We all know the Wright brothers, Orville and Wilbur, as pioneers of powered flight. On December 17, 1903, they launched their Flyer 1, soaring 36 meters in 12 seconds. But here's the twist. Were they really the first to conquer the skies, or just the most famous? While the Wright brothers' achievement was groundbreaking, Gustav Whitehead allegedly flew two years earlier in 1901, covering two kilometers at 60 meters altitude. Even earlier, Clément Otter's steam-powered Eole managed a short hop in 1890, though control issues grounded further success. Alberto Santos Dumont's 14 Bs soared in 1906, taking off unaided and landing gracefully. Crucially, he performed in front of thousands, earning official recognition from the Aero Club de France. His flight remains a strong claim to the first, based on public visibility and certification. Debates linger on who flew first, depending on definitions like piloting, engine power, takeoff methods, and public documentation. The Wright brothers were trailblazers in their engineering, from designing aerodynamic propellers to achieving controlled flight. Yet, others shaped aviation's long, complex journey. Curiosity keeps innovation alive. Share your thoughts in the comments. Who deserves the first to fly title? Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more untold stories of innovation. Fly high with us on this quest for knowledge.